Hey, my fast builders. He got another light out here. So, he got ourselves a bad ballast. I already took that thing out. So, uh, he had the bulbs here, replacement bulbs. I mean, actually, those are the bulbs in the original fixture. And here's the replacement ballast. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna get it open up and put a bulb in. <coughs> and so, uh, that will deter, that will let me know if it was a bad ballast or something else. So, uh, yeah, I'll, you see there's these little clips here. Oh, hold on, my ladder's not stable. I have to get that stabled up. See this clip here? That may come down. There's another one on the other side. And that just pops right out there. And see, you have the wires, you have your main line here, your line, wires coming from that side, and your other wires coming from that side. So yeah, I'll be, I'll come back and, uh, just, I'll come back and, uh, yeah, and for the next step after I stabilize the ladder. All right, my fast builders, I uh, put two bulbs in. And this will be determined determine the uh, how uh, the ballast was our culprit. So now I'll show you uh, how to like strip the, all this insulated wire off of here. And so uh, yeah, oh, there we go. All right, like I'm not very good. I'll show you how to str strip off these uh, wires. So, uh, hey, I'm gonna move the ladder over more so I can just set this down. You can see it. But normally, though, in a four lamp fixture, you would have all four bulbs and you would have to take the two middle ones out to get that ballast cover off. And then that screw right there is where you would secure it. So, yeah, I don't know if this is gonna hit. Uh, yeah, it'll hit. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, I got my strippers that you can see. So what you want to do, like you see this here will cut off your wire. And these here, you have to find the right size, and it will uh, strip the coating off. So, so you have to do it a certain way or it won't work. You want to strip off about a, an inch. Hey, that wasn't the right size. You gotta go further. Not, uh, that wasn't the right size. Or I go this way. There we go. And then you want to make sure you cut it off. So make sure it's going to be straight. So I see I cut off a little too much. So I'm going to strip it down a bit more. And if it's not if it's not picking up, I'm going to I'm going to like throw it down when I do the ballast. And see this uh, strip, these wires up. And the last one on this side, 
and then I will uh, uh, I will uh, uh, yeah, I will uh, okay, like so now I will pause the video and I will uh, do the other side, do the next step. So I can see I stripped the wires. That one might be a little too big. But it, who knows? So yeah, I will. I will uh, come back later. All right, this is the replacement ballast. Has the same number of wires as they are up there. Hey, look, I have a little somebody. Hi. You're gonna be on YouTube. What? I don't. I will edit that out. <laughs> so this is the replacement ballast. I will show you what I did up there if it didn't get, if it didn't like a catch. After I open up it up from the plastic, gotta open that up. Oh, you're, fit, you're, you're the maintenance guy tonight? Yep, I am mm. filming a video. You're I'm, what? I'm filming a video on it. Oh, you're smart. Yep. Yeah, because this one's been out since we were in our class. What? Yep. What? What? Yep, uh, that was, went out. Yeah. How you been? All right. Good, good. Good to see you always. One, yep. two, three. Three. All right. So you have this really long wire. Uh, they can't, they, that's the way it is so when you first put it in. So, yeah, I'll show you. I'll show you what it uh, there, what it did for a distance. In case you didn't see it. So I'm gonna cut this wire clean. Just to show an example. See? Okay, so now, like, so now I will uh, strip it. So, and like that. So now, I'll show you how to put the new ballast in. Alright, see there's this old this screw right here, yeah that's what's going to support this baby. And to make, I recommend you put the ballast in first before you do all the wiring. Do you have, are you recording that to your phone or what? I'm, re I'm recording a video. And you see you have these uh, slits. This slit here, so you will, you're gonna put that in the slit and then line it up. It might be a little hard to get in the hole, so you gotta work it. The screw supports the ballast, and this is based because there's no ground wire on this. The metal is your grounding. All right, so now that's in there. So now I recommend, look at all that long wire from the ballast. I'll cut that down so you don't have to deal with all that. And uh, yeah, I don't, I don't think you really need to see that. So 
I'll come back with the next step to show you how to wire it. So there you go. That's how you put the ballast in. All right, sorry that took a while on my fast builders. I just trimmed down the, the excess wire. And now the fun part is, whoa, I'm gonna spill off there. We're going to be wiring all those wires. Uh, and now you're probably wondering how I'm gonna do that. With these six wires here, and normally it would be black and white as well, but we have some push connectors so, and they have some extra space in there. So I might do that, I might not. I'm still debating on that. But anyway, I'm gonna do the other wires first. So I'm gonna show you how that is done with an example wire here. So what you want, yellow, doesn't matter which yellow goes to which yellow, it just needs to be a one-to-one -one ratio. So uh, you wanna get both your wires in there. I don't know if you can see it, but you're gonna wanna twist your wires. You wanna make sure both wires are in there. And then you uh, twist your nut. Make sure it's a tight connection. And so, uh, and then you do uh, kind of bunch your wire up. So it's a lot easier to put the ballast cover on. So try to bunch it up to the best you can. So you don't want to squish your wires. All right. So that looks good. I'll do the other yellow. So. Oh, I might I think it might be easier if I set the camera down here. So I'll do the other yellow. Put the nut on. Who's almost almost done. What? I'm almost done. Alright. The fun part, wiring it. Twist the nut. Isn't that kind of the scary part because you can, you have a chance of getting shot? If you know if you know what you're doing, if you know what you're doing, you won't get shot. Just the wires up. Well, do you want me to hand you the bolts? Huh? Do you want me to hand you the bolts? Not yet. I need a. I need to get a drain. Okay. I have two test bulbs in there already. I have to strip the wires. And you know when you cut the wire, right? I mean, I insulate it, right? You have to cut the wire and it takes off the insulation. Oh. That's a wrench. All right, so since I showed you two things here, I don't think you need to see me do the other six wires. So I will hopefully see you next, the next time I push play, it will be with these lights lit. All right, guys, I got it all wired up. I'm gonna leave my, my video here and go flip it on. Moment of truth. Yep, those two bulbs light. At the back, there was a ballast. So it was the ballast then. Yep. And there you go, viewers. 
That that was. Now the fun part, we can all the wires together and might be able to put that over it. What are your viewers at? Alright. Hey, I'll see you after we get everything hooked up. Play 121. 321 on YouTube. And there you that's the finished product. The light is working again. So thank you, my best builders, for following me on this journey. <laughs>